welcome back to Grow with the Jan family. I'm Anjali and today we are going to be reacting to the 10 top 10 most richest temples in India. Yes. So we did the top 10 famous temples in India, so I'm assuming we might see some we've already seen before. And um, we did a little bit about um, Lord Krishna and Lord Shiva, mm -hmm. and we watched uh, Sadhguru. So we've, we're learning a little bit. I know this is like somebody said, you're just like, we're Grazing just the touching the surface. And so when like you send us these great comments and these great links, um, we're learning more and more about India, which we love. So yes, we're so start it up. Yes. 10 richest temples of India. Number 10, Kashi Vishwanath Temple, Varanasi. One of the oldest and richest temples of Lord Shiva in India, Kashi Vishwanath Temple still stands in glory despite being looted and demolished several wow, times in past. Wow. With a documented history of like over 3,500 yeah. years, Varanasi is also the oldest living city in the world. Wow. It is estimated that around over 3 million domestic and 200,000 foreign tourists visit this temple annually. Every year, Number that's nine, a lot. Somnath <laughs> Temple, Gujarat. It is believed that the moon god, Chandra, Chandra. created a temple of gold in yeah, honor of Lord Shiva yeah. here. Mm -hmm. Presently Lord built Shiva. on the Chalukya style of architecture, the temple has been that's destroyed and reconstructed really several pretty. times yeah. by both like Islamic and Hindu right? emperors. Yeah. The results of a recently conducted survey revealed that the temple has accumulated a wealth of around 17,000 million rupees. Number 8. The Golden Temple, Amritsar. Officially known as the Harmander Sahib, the temple gets visits from over 40,000 people every day. Apart from its splendid exteriors, even the ceiling of this temple has been designed with gold. Despite the fact that the total temple assets remains unknown, experts claim that the Golden Temple is one of the wealthiest temple in India. So Number 7. Vaishno Devi, Jammu and Kashmir. Glad we're not saying one of the these oldest names. and richest temples in India, the shrine of Mata Vaishno Devi is visited by millions of devotees from across the world. Center of deep rooted religious beliefs of the Hindus. The temple has an annual income of around 5,000 million. Every year around 8 million pilgrims visit this temple like and it is claimed to be the second anywhere. most yeah. visited temple after Venkateswara Temple. Number 6. Jagannath Temple, Puri. Jagannath. We saw the Jagannath Most of popular festival, annual right? Yatra, Remember? The temple yeah, has been robbed 18 times in the past. Festival. The and temple receives these. donation of around rupees yes. 15,000 to 20,000 with yes. six times more we donations in festive season. More than 30,000 devotees throng the shrine every day, and yes. around 70,000 like per day in festive people. season. In 2011, people, officials so stumbled upon 522 old silver slabs weighing about 18 tons, wow. worth rupees 900 million. Like Number 5. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Meenakshi Amon Temple, Madurai. The richest temple in Tamil Nadu like attracts 15,000 like visitors that. each They're day. So like Apart from devotees, yeah. thousands of tourists also wow. visit this famous shrine to feast their them. eyes upon yeah. this splendid ancient Indian really really architecture, works. housing estimated 33,000 wow. sculptures. 33, the temple earns revenue sculptures. of around 60 That's million every <laughs> year. Meenakshi Amman Temple was also among the 30 nominees for the new seven wonders of the world. Wow. Number 4. City Vinayak. Mumbai. Mumbai. One of the most famous landmarks Ooh, of the coastal city of Mumbai, one. City Vinayak witnesses around 25,000 to 200,000 worshippers visiting the place wow. each day. The temple day. provides their devotees options That's of so entering the shrine faster through special paid queues, which also helps in the increase like in the, the temple's income. It looks a little According bit more to a survey conducted in 2010-11, the temple earned approximately 490 million rupees in just a single year, of which 450 million were garnered through donations alone. Number 3, Sai Baba Temple, Charity. Indians, irrespective of the region they belong to, like that, have like, a strong uh, belief in the miracles of Sai Baba. Like a deck. And perhaps yeah. that is the reason why people like have donated of. so much to this temple that it has turned out to be the third richest temple in the country. Wow. 
visited by the people of all religions. This divine travel destination possesses gold and silver jewelry worth approximately rupees 320 million. The annual donation received by the temple wow. reaches up to That's an amount of around 3600 million. Number 2. Tirumala Tirupati Venkate Swara Temple, Tirumala. Maybe till last decade, Tirupati like Temple was believed to be the richest on temple on in the country. But Ooh, after the reports so disclosing the unbelievable really amount of assets possessed by our number one, wow. Tirupati has gone pieces. down to the and second position like in terms of yeah, possessing like wealth. Every day around 60,000 so devotees pretty. throng at the temple. Each year the temple treasury brings in over six million dollars by selling the shaved hairs of devotees at public auction. The temple makes 150,000 ladus each day that garners over 11 million rupees revenue annually. Number 1. Padmanabhaswami Temple, Kerala The temple got credited with the title of the richest Hindu temple in the world after its secret chambers were ordered open by Supreme Court of India. The amount of wealth found inside is town and the entire world. The treasure that was reported to be found includes antique gold ornaments, golden crowns, golden bow, sack full of diamonds and thousands of antique jewelry, studded with diamonds and emeralds. Moreover, if taken into account the antique and cultural significance of the object, the asset will be ten times the current market price, not to mention, one of the vaults named Vault B remains closed till date. Those temples. I mean, there was a few we had seen in the last one, but yeah. there was a few new ones. And yeah. um, the ones that have gold on them are just so amazing. I mean, yeah. they're beautiful. Um, and I like the structures that kind of come up. Yeah, one um, of my favorites tall. was the... Um, the white one with like the gold tips. I think mm. like that color coordination looked really yeah. good. Yeah, and to see, you know, some of the the ones that we had seen, like the Jagannath, we did that mm -hmm. uh, at the festival. So we got to see like the carts again and stuff. Mm -hmm. That was, it's so colorful and so beautiful. Yeah. Like, um, it's just so amazing. And some of these places, they get just as many people from outside to go see them as from inside. You know, yeah. people come from all over the world to see, and you can see why. I mean, um, you know, not just the structure themselves, but the amount of sculptures, the amount of time each one of these buildings took yeah. to make. And I bet, like, while you're, here's the thing. So while I'm doing something, sometimes it's, like, homework or sometimes it's, like, a drawing. It takes, like, work, and I'm like, Ugh. <laughs> but after I'm done with it, I look at it and I'm like proud. They must be really proud. But while they're doing it, they're like, this is a lot. I'm <laughs> sure to sculpt those stones. I mean, all those sculptures are all hand carved. Yeah. And to do those all by hand took many, many years, I'm sure, to build these beautiful, beautiful temples. And yeah, I'm sure. They feel really proud. Um, if they, you know, lived long enough to see the end result. Yeah. Uh, even just like to to do one of the sculptures of the gods or the devotees yeah. on the side, like, and to be done. I'm sure, like, in the sun, you're hot and you're doing it, but, mm -hmm. you know, you do it because you love it, and then yeah. when it's done, yeah, it's this beautiful temple that... It's like, I did that sculpture right there! Yeah, hopefully, you know, the people looking down from above are, are saying, like, how great it is that all these things they built, you know, are yeah. being seen by many, many people, not just, um you know, the devotees, but by everybody around the world, and they're so beautiful. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, so exciting. And I want to learn more about each one. Like, they were talking just mainly about they were the richest ones, and we saw some that were just, like, the top ten temples. So it would be nice to learn maybe about each one individually, or, you know, why, you know, some of them were for Lord Shiva and some for Lord Krishna. Um, you know, they're different gods that are kind of inside so it'd be interesting to learn a little bit more so send us some more links yes. um, different temples that you'd like us to do or um, you know and if you like things. this video don't forget to click that like button down below because the more you like it the more YouTube shares our videos and don't forget to subscribe and we do videos every single day so we'll see you tomorrow bye, bye.